Hi folks, Max from HighlandAndroid.com where we get on Android every day. Uh, anyway, I've got another ROM suggestion for you guys. This is the Hazy ROM uh, for the GTI 9100 users out there. And this is running the latest Android 5.0.2. Last time we looked at it, everything was kind of alpha. Um, it is still alpha, but it's gotten a lot better, uh, hence this update. This is a Hazy ROM. And it's basically CM12, uh, basically a custom build of CM12, adds uh, some additional features. Now everything is working out of the box, uh, except um, Netflix replay is not working, uh, GPS is working, Bluetooth is working, NFC, all that good stuff. So if Netflix is an issue for you, um, you might want to stick with KitKat. But if it's not, you can enjoy the latest and best uh, lollipop. And also camera works just fine also. This is actually a KitKat camera on there. Google camera doesn't work, but uh, this is just as good. Um, so you can take photos, uh, video recording works, and it's not bad. You can also pause, oops, there we go. Pause and record and stop and focus also. Uh, pretty nice stuff for the Galaxy S2 GTI 9100. And uh, I did see the battery gets, the stats gets a little bit funky sometimes, so use battery calibrator app and uh, charge your phone all the way and then um, calibrate it and you should have no problems. And uh, let me, battery life itself is eh, fairly normal. It's not outstanding or, you know, bad or anything like that. It's just, it's just normal. And also let me go ahead and show you some of the customizations you can do. Uh, with the status bar, you get a little bit more than uh, regular CM12. And uh, you can go ahead and customize your tiles. And also there's uh, buttons you can customize, power menu, you can go ahead and add a screenshot, reboot, all that good stuff. And double tap, you can also um, change the action for all of your hardware buttons, which is nice. And I think there's a couple more things I can show you. Uh, sound and notification, all right, that's something not too new. Uh, also, you have double tap to sleep, uh, if you want to double tap to sleep on the status bar. Ah. Sorry, this angle of the camera makes it uh, hard for me to press it. Uh, overall, it is very nice ROM, uh, very fast, uh, so if you want the latest lollipop um, and you don't, you don't use Netflix, then um, try this one out. Uh, and do let me know what you think. But I'll keep having updates. Lollipop's probably not great yet. I mean, it's not perfect. Uh, it's still a work in progress. If you want really solid ROM, go back to like KitKat because KitKat is really solid. Everything works. Uh, other than that, it's a solid ROM. This is the best one I've seen for the GTI 9100. Well, that's why I'm recommending it. Uh, yeah, and that's it. Oh, I totally forgot. Uh, starting with Lollipop, that's different from KitKat. Uh, any uh, above 32 gigs of micro SD will be supported uh, before you have to format it as NTFS. Now, XFAT is supported just like TouchWiz ROMs. Uh, one of the reasons a lot of you were just running TouchWiz, you can see my 64 gigabyte are uh, reading fine and I didn't do anything. So, that's one really cool thing with Lollipop. Anyway, I just want to add that. And thanks guys for watching this video. This is my second YouTube channel covering the ROMs and my extra videos. If you want to see my main videos, go ahead and subscribe uh, to my main channel over at Zetomax, uh, where I cover stuff like the Nexus 6, the Note Edge, uh, Note 4, and all of the latest Android gadgets. And I'll see you guys soon. As always, stay on Android.